So uh, today, I'm not sure if it'll be fun for people, but we will see rain off and on throughout the day. Some people sort of like that thing. Uh, we're taking a live look outside right now where we have mostly cloudy skies and 60 degrees uh, temperatures right now. The winds are calm. So what we are dealing with or what we will be dealing with today, tree pollen will be high. So that's one thing that we have to deal with today. Grass will be low, ragweed, mold, and weeds all low. But uh, tree pollen, even though it's high yesterday, was very high. So this is actually a step in the right direction as far as allergens go. Your SkyCast satellite and radar. I mean, take a look. You can see we do have some rain moving through, and I think this will be the case off and on throughout the day. We'll see periods of rain, most of it light, but you might be able to make out where we've had some yellow in there. That shows us where we're seeing some heavier downpours. So we have some moderate to heavy downpours. Thunderstorms are also going to be a possibility, especially uh, as we head into the afternoon and evening hours. So where we see thunderstorm cells, we will see some of that heavier rain as well. This is the big picture. Uh, so what we're dealing with, an area of low pressure, and this is the associated cold front. So this is all activity along that frontal boundary. Turning on your future cast and showing you how it is handling things. Again, so we see some rain off and on throughout the day. This particular model shows a lot of the rain sort of skirting just north of our area. I would just say be prepared to see some of these moderate to heavy downpours as we head throughout the afternoon and evening, especially uh, as we head into tomorrow, a chance for some leftover moisture. But really the bigger story tomorrow will be the gusty winds. It won't be as much about the rain. For tomorrow, we start out with 31 mile an hour wind gusts in New York City. We watch that go up to about 38 uh, mile an hour gusts by 5 p.m. And then we get into the 40s. We'll see 40 and 50 mile an hour gusts potentially for your Friday night. So gusty winds, and then it finally starts to subside as we head into your Saturday morning. So the weekend itself is actually looking pretty good. Uh, we start off obviously a little windy on your Saturday morning. Then we see just some leftover sort of breezy conditions with mostly sunny skies, a high of 65. Sunday temperatures. Uh, will be bouncing back into the 70s. And in fact, once we get back into the 70s on Sunday, we kind of stay there for a while. So today, this 70 degree temperature, the 74 degree forecast high does represent a significant cool down over what we had yesterday. Uh, but again, the bigger story today will be the rain. So you'll want to grab that umbrella as you head out the door. Tonight, we dip down to 58 degrees. We'll see showers, isolated thunderstorms potentially, and some blustery conditions as the winds pick up. But the weekend actually looks very nice. And then beyond that, some pretty mild temperatures. With that, I'll send it back to you. Elise, thank you.